What's going on guys, Aussie here and welcome back to a brand new video. So today we are player reviewing Inform Bergwin. I think that's how you pronounce it. If it's wrong, put it in the comments how I'm meant to pronounce it. Now, 5 foot 10, medium, medium. Medium is not the greatest, but I don't really mind that as he's a left winger. Right footed, right foot, left footed, doesn't matter, but this matters a lot. Two star weak foot. You're going to probably notice that if I try to shoot on his left foot, you're going to see that shot probably go off target. If it goes in, it goes in. Happy days. But if it goes off target, you know why. Now, four-star skills, quality. Fortunately, he is not fresh. Some guy decided he wanted to play one game with him, score a quick goal, get an assist, and list him straight up. There will be questions asked. Anyway, 90 acceleration, 92 sprint speed, 89 attacking positioning, quick maths, 94... I think it's 94 finishing, not a great is that maths. 89 short power, 77 long shots, 82 volleys. He's got 80 penalties as well. So the finishing aspect, he's looking quality. He have based that, he has 89 shot power. I am using a sniper on him. He is on 10 chemistry. So 89 short passing. I'm impressed. I'm impressed with that short passing already. Now, what I'm not impressed about is his long passing. His long passing does not look the greatest. But 92 agility, 98 balance, 89 reactions, 94 ball control, 99 dribbling, 85 composure. This guy is going to feel like a god, hopefully. Now, 85 stamina is perfect. Literally, you can't get any better than that. It's For an inform, I'm actually quite surprised he has 85 stamina. Now, 84 strength. That is huge on a player that is 5 foot 10. That's huge. 46 aggression is not the greatest. Obviously, I'd prefer him into the 70s, 80s, but we're going to see how that comes into play. Now, apparently, he doesn't have a picture. What an EA. But he is around Hullet, Ronaldo, Nangolo, Messi, etc. But I'm obviously going to be foc focusing on him. So let's get straight into the games. Nice. Nice, good composure, good finish. I like that. Good turn. Quick feet. Pass to Messi. Can you finish your dinner? Yes, you can. Really good pass, really good skill move. Nice. Good ball roll. Can you finish your dinner? Yes, you can. That's not a bad keeper as well. It's called the Stegen. So, I mean, he's finishing his dinner so far. I think this guy is going to rage quit. Nice. Good passing play. Really nice. Show me what you can do. Show me what you can do. Beautiful touches. Pass back to him. Go around your player. Full pelter near post. It's there. So far, his finishing has been so good. He feels nice on the ball. He's got a beautiful first time, uh, first time pass. Hey, what can I say so far? That's nice. What a run. Finish your dinner. Finish it. I went for the spectacular. I'm not going to lie. I could have obviously gone all the way, I feel like. But why not give it a go? Let's see what you can do. Look at the acceleration. Look at him. Look how much confidence he has. Oh, unlucky. Quick turn. Quick finish. I tell you right now, he's very, very, very agile. Use that. Look at him. Look how quick turning he is. You see what I mean? Look at this. Look at this. You see all these little touches? They're, they're perfect. I lost the ball because I was just showing you guys, but he feels very, very agile. I'm not going to lie. He takes all these tiny touches you want him to take. Beautiful run. Just going to cut back. See right there? That's my fault. He did well just to get it past the first person, I feel like. Really good run. He's got no one in support, so I'm just going to go like this. Go like this. Go like this. Oh, my God. Can you finish it? Oh, that's so unlucky. Look at him. Look at his strength. He showed just great strength there, man. Beautiful. 
Kind of a big touch there. He still managed to get it. He's done the keeper. Oh, that was nice close control dribbling though. That's good pace. Come on. Kind of readable. Can he? It's a beautiful hit. Oh. Good pace. This is against Virgil van Dijk. Let's see what we can do. He just absolutely left. Oh, that could have been an amazing pass. He left Virgil in the dust. Nice run. Okay, that wasn't the greatest defending, but you can't take anything away from the finishing. That's what I'm going to say. Beautiful pass. Especially with his weak foot. This should be a finish by Lionel Messi. Yes, it is. He's there. I see him. He came short. Can he play this ball? Look how perfect the ball is. Boys, this that's his weak foot. That's his weak foot. And he's doing them through balls with. It's it's perfect, literally. You can't you would don't want any better than that. Nice. Full pelter, near post. Very unfortunate. Let's give it back to him. Gonna go for a finesse. AI blocked. Nice. Use that strength. Use that pace. Come on. Do you see a run? Nice little option. Can you squeeze it? Yes, he can. I only did one ball roll, EA. He's in. He made a perfect run. He's used the strength. Can you finish it? No, he can't. Maybe I could have took a, took a like... A few more touches, maybe. But he did really well just to get there. Good turn. Bye. Bye. Can you finish your dinner? Yes, he can. Hey, that all I'm saying is his shot is crazy. Can you get there? He did kind of get there, but Ronaldo's ball was not good enough. Beautiful. He's moved the keeper once again. I'm going to be on that now. The problem with going on that side is that he has that two-star weak foot, which I'm scared to shoot with. That's a downgrade of a move, man. Full pelt it, near post, beautiful finish. Come on. This guy's trying his hardest. I'm not going to lie. It's going to be a hard game. Come on. Go for the gap. Right there, if he was faster, just a tiny bit faster, I reckon he would have got through. I had to be patient there. That animation that he got after taking that touch. Needs to finish that. I held B as well, so I didn't even load driven any of that, and he went load driven. Good strength, good pace. Finish is not there, unfortunately. Nice. Nice, good footwork. Can he finish it? No, he can't. This guy's finesses are not great, I'm not going to lie. Beautiful pass. Kind of calm and composed. Calm and composed. It's beautiful. See, right there, he can easily do that with his weak foot, but he's decided to go with his strong foot. EA, what's happened? You're giving him wrong animations. Come on. Good touch. See, right there, it's just his dribbling. His dribbling wasn't fast enough to get round that corner, which just annoys me so much. It's like he didn't take the greatest touch straight off the back. That's why I've noticed, though, his first touch is not great. What a run. See, right there, I'm holding RT. I don't know if it's the game now, because I'm starting to get a bit pissed off with him. But he does have a free kick from, what, 24 yards out? Quick guess, quick guess. 26. Now, we're going to go for the little glitch where you red time it. That's around three bars. Can you finish it? 
Let's not talk about it. Let's not talk about it. So it's time to review him. And let me just say straight off the back, you can see that two-star weak foot come into play. It's not the greatest with shooting, but I didn't notice it with passing, which is a bit weird because I was obviously passing on his weak foot and his strong foot, and they felt the same. He had an amazing short pass. His long passing, surprisingly, is not 66. It's around in the 80 zone. He does have an amazing long pass, which is weird saying that they do have 66 on the card. But I compare this card to a Scream card Triore. The only thing about this card that doesn't feel the same as Triore is his pace. I feel like he doesn't have 90 acceleration. He doesn't have that 92 sprint speed. His finishing is there. I, I realise that his finesse shots are horrible. So I would, you know, if you're going to be using this card, do not finesse shot with him. Power shot in near post. Do whatever you need to do. But trust me, do not finesse with this card. It's terrible. Now, 92 agility. I felt it at first, but started to get used to him a little bit. I don't know if it's the gameplay that obviously changed. But he started to feel a bit more clunky. He started to turn less. He started to do all some weird stuff. Now, 84 strength. I do believe that is a lie. I didn't see the strength there. I was get he was getting bodied off the ball. Obviously, it was centre backs that was bodying him off the ball, and 84 strength. I doubt they had. I think they probably had more. But he was just getting bullied left, right, and centre. The 46 aggression. I do see he doesn't fight for the badge, like promised it. Promised fight for fight. Uh, fought for the badge, but this guy doesn't fight for it. Now, his finishing, I did come into play with his finishing. His finishing is really, really good, obviously. Just make sure you stay away from them finesse shots. Four-star skills. I did kind of enjoy his four-star skills because he can obviously do the scoop turn, and the scoop turn is really overpowered this year. But to come into play, 40k and promises 40k, personally, I would tell you guys to go get promise. Do not go get this card. But out of 10, a rating, I would give a 5 out of 10. I'm not going to be too harsh because he could finish. And he had a tiny bit of pace and he could move a little bit. But other than that, I just couldn't see this card being in the meta. But if you guys did enjoy this play review, leave a like, leave a comment, and peace.